Backlit keyboards make typing in low light conditions a whole lot easier. And if you just bought your laptop within the last few years, chances are you have one. However, just because you have the hardware for a backlit keyboard doesn't mean it's working properly. If Windows 10 is keeping your keyboard's backlight from turning on or off, we've got you covered. There are two ways to get your backlit keyboard working in Windows 10, using Windows Mobility Center and using the native keyboard app that comes with your laptop. Let's look at how each method works. Regardless of who manufactures your laptop, Windows Mobility Center is included by default. To get there, we'll have to head into Control Panel. Tap on the Windows key on your keyboard, then type Control Panel and hit Enter. Click on Hardware and Sound, then look for Windows Mobility Center. This opens an app on your computer capable of changing some key settings for your PC, including brightness and power options. On some laptops where the maker has included keyboard controls specific for their device, you'll likely find the option to control your keyboard backlight here. Once you're done making changes, hit OK to save. However, more and more companies have moved from using standard Windows-based options to giving users custom apps included on their PC. Samsung, for example, includes keyboard backlighting settings in their own Samsung Settings app, while Dell includes some Dell-specific keyboard shortcuts for enabling and disabling the backlight. Other laptops, especially ones designed for gaming, have entire programs built into controlling the brightness and lighting effects. Razer, for example, includes Razer Synapse on all of their laptops, which allow you to set specific keyboard colors and motion effects. If you're unsure how the keyboard is controlled on your laptop, the easiest way is to search for your specific laptop's make and model with Google, adding the phrase enable keyboard backlight. If none of these options work, you can try using the built-in Windows Troubleshooter for possible solutions. Hit the Windows key on your laptop and type Troubleshoot, then hit Enter. This opens the troubleshooting menu in your laptop's settings. Select Keyboard from the list of options, then run the troubleshooter. If Windows finds an issue with your hardware, follow the steps provided to try to automatically solve it. If you liked this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Windows 10 and other technology. And do not forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.